don't tell anyone, but I was born a red. But that's what Everton does see it. And this city does see it. It's people that make a city the friendliest place. It stays with you. I'm so proud to call this city home. Places like Toxteth have made the Sunday Times best places to live list. Sponsored by Halifax. In this city, everyone talks. If you go downtown, that is the biggest thing for me. So friendly. The people make it. It's home. It's like coming home. I was fortunate enough to sign for this great football club. And even more fortunate to win things here. As a schoolboy, that was the ultimate. You know, when I... I, I I played for England, which, you know, I, I was lucky, you know, won't play the year, but playing for Everton was the best. Money can't buy that. It's just, it's, it's the ultimate in being a footballer, you know, Peter Reid, Everton. Just got a nice little ring about it for me. It's a dream come true. This is uh, King George V playing fields where, as a young boy, I started playing footy. This is where it, uh, it started for me, playing um, every day. I used to be out kicking the ball, you know, ruining my shoes, my mum, my mum giving me stick. So it's always nice coming back, always nice coming back. There's a, many famous footballers, um, Stephen Gerrard, that direction for about a mile, Bluebell Estate, he was brought up there, Stephen Gerrard, and I was, I was brought up on, on the Moscroft. The beauty about these spaces, these pitches, is that girls and boys, I'm, and I'm delighted now there's a lot, lot more girls playing football. It's brilliant. But that's what it's about, isn't it? You know, enjoying life, getting out there, it's exercise, it's good for the youngsters. This is the lifeblood of football. Well, being in this grounds, it's iconic and being fortunate enough to play for Everton Football Club was a dream come true for me. You know, highest winning trophies here, fantastic. And the support we got in this old ground was absolutely brilliant, brilliant support. If you travel through the world and people ask you, you say, yeah, I'm from the city of Liverpool. It's, you're proud of it. And that's all you can say. Proud to be from this, this part of the world. Proud to be born in this brilliant city of Liverpool. Well, I think everybody around the world knows them, you know, and Liverpool as a city have got two great football clubs. We're moving from this magnificent old traditional ground to further in this city on the Mersey itself. Could you imagine what that's going to do for the city, for Liverpool as a city? Everton's iconic new stadium on the banks of the River Mersey. It's just magnificent. As much as we'll miss the old lady, Goodison Park, progress. The people, the nightlife, the humour, two great football clubs in, in this wonderful city of Liverpool. That's it. Everything condensed into one. And like you say, if you can't have a good time in Liverpool, you can't have a good time anywhere.